Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. Hope you all are doing well. It is day two of Autobahn and uh, everyone's car is running. We had some issues yesterday, which I'll talk about in a second. I basically got the check ride to go to comp school next year and it was okayed by the instructor. So huge accomplishment for the weekend. Uh, we just gotta stay safe, maintain uh, whatever we're doing out there. <laughs> Uh, and continue to keep learning as well even though you know we got the okay to go to comm school that doesn't mean the learning stops so we're gonna keep going I'll give you guys a walkthrough of what happened yesterday uh, Kyle who's regularly with us at NASA events uh, you usually see him with the CTR he's got his prelude here this weekend um, overheating issues uh, it's turbo it's still H series uh, big turbo too it was making 500 horsepower before he detuned it a little bit it's 350 now but here it is uh, yesterday it started getting real hot. It's got these heating issues because uh, turbo, uh, but you know the front end is ducted uh, really well. Kyle is an engineer slash fabricator, so everything's done really well. It got hot on track yesterday, came off, and then it died. We're trying to figure it out. I had S Manager, the laptop hooked up to it. Throttle position was responding the way it should. The map sensor was responding the way it should. Kind of did these like modified power balance tests with. Um, the ignition side of the system and the fuel side and they didn't really make any changes at all um, But he's got a wide band gauge and it was reading about 9.8 It was in the nines nine to one air fuel ratio You had to have the gas pedal down for it in order to run so clearly it's some rich condition and then I was looking around and I noticed this AM fuel pressure regulator. Well, this is actually the new one, but the issue ended up being his uh, old AM fuel pressure regulator. We pulled one of the vacuum lines off going to the intake and uh, turned the ignition on and fuel came spraying right out. So it was running really, really rich to the point where it would just kill the motor. Um, I've had that happen to my very own AM fuel pressure regulator before, but the H series shares the B series uh, fitment for the fuel pressure regulators. So I hollered at a couple buddies and uh, some of the homies came through. So. This is uh, from Seb, uh, Seb's Garage, which is <laughs> conveniently where I keep my car as well. Seb definitely came through, uh, allowed us to borrow it, or I don't know the deal they made, but uh, we got it on here, Kyle installed it, and the car started right up. So, shout out to Seb for coming through with that fuel pressure regulator. Since we're on that topic, you guys are looking for fit parts. Seb has started developing quite a few uh, really good uh, track-oriented fit parts. The tow hook that I have in my car, this is a Seb's Garage tow hook, uh, specifically designed for the fit, but we found out that it also works for EG, EK, Integra, chassis as well. Whatever it is, if you guys want some fit parts, hit up Seb at sebs-garage.com.
last session. Man, I always take the last session really uh, slowly. I don't want to say really slowly, but uh, very conservatively, conservatively, so I don't make any mistakes, have a major off at the end of a successful event, kind of. It was just driving within my limits. I was very conscious of what was going on with the car. I was very in tune with uh, if the tires were falling off or not, and then I had decent grip throughout the whole session. They did start to fall off, I mean, a little bit, but I was aware of it and adjusted uh, accordingly. But I did, if y'all look at that, I PB'd again, 138.2. Just like that, Autobahn is done. Everyone's still packing up. I still am cleaning all my crap up, but successful weekend, successful end to 2023. We are all done for the year. Comp school next year. There's gonna be quite a bit of car prep uh, to get ready for that, but, but everyone's going home with working cars. And uh, yeah, nice clear day and a little bit hot right now, but sun's starting to go down, starting to cool down a little bit. But if you're still here, thank you so much for following my journey uh, through this wheel to wheel kind of thing that I'm doing here. I don't really know what I'm doing, but I guess we're on pace. We're on, uh, we're, we're getting what we want done, uh, comp school next year, and uh, we're just gonna keep pushing, getting better. So thank you for following along. Once again, if you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you wanna stay up to date with my progress as a driver. Uh, like this weekend and updates on the car go ahead and subscribe to the channel and if you would like go ahead and share the video because it definitely helps out the channel but until the next video stay safe stay smooth see you guys in the next video